going on? Mark Abrera, themonterayhell.com slash the beat. And we're here at Wave Street Studios and we're hanging out with our boys from August Sky right here. Hi. Hi. Why don't you go ahead and introduce yourselves, man? Uh, um, I'm Eric. I'm the vocalist and lead guitarist of August Sky. Um, I'm Nathan and I'm the drummer and slash vocals of August Sky. And I'm Mark Abrera, features writer for the Monterey County Herald. And I write also for the beat. Uh, we're here talking with the boys from August Sky. You guys are uh, just uh, part of the one of the young, hip, up and coming uh, bands out of the Salinas area. Talk to me a little bit about um, how you guys got started playing music at such a young age. Um, well, our parents just liked the music and uh, they just listened to it a lot with us when we were little. And we just kind of followed along. Mm -hmm. I forgot to ask you guys, how old are you guys? What grade are you guys in? Uh, I'm in seventh grade at Buena Vista Middle School. And I'm uh, at eighth grade at Buena Vista Middle School. I'm 13. I'm also 13. 13 years old. 13 years old. And they're already rocking out, uh, going on. You guys are good, heading out to Los, Los Angeles this, this weekend, is that right? Yeah. Yes. What are you guys, uh, are you guys excited about that? Uh, what, what are you guys anticipating? Um, well, we're gonna play at the Knitting Factory, and so I'm I'm pretty excited. I just I haven't really been to Hollywood very really much. You haven't? No, I've never been to Hollywood actually. Never, huh? No. How about you? You been out to down to LA to Hollywood? Before? I've been there once to um, watch In Excess play there. Really? Mm-hmm. How long ago was that? I don't know, like two years ago or something. Two years ago, way back when you were ten, eleven years old. <laughs> So uh, these guys play classic rock and also their own original covers, but you guys play a lot of classic rock and a lot of blues songs that are like three or four times older than your ages. Just tell me uh, what, uh, what influenced you guys to, to cover these, these uh, older songs? It was mostly his dad. Well, I think his dad started with him yeah. and I didn't really know anything about it. I just heard it at like school and then I came over and I started with them. Then I heard all about it, and then I just started with them. The hunter, wild and proud. The hunter, don't mess around. The hunter, it's guilty, not for allowed. He fights to live, not lives to fight. He fights for honor. Now these songs, some of the songs that you guys cover were written decades before before you guys were even born. I mean, is, is there any is there any uh, part of you that, that that maybe like just wants to uh, cover more modern stuff, or was it was there always like? Did you always want to do these old covers and, and, and do the classic rock stuff? I like the uh, classic rock also because uh, some of the newer stuff uh, doesn't usually use the instruments that we use. A lot of the newer stuff like rap and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. and, like, and they don't use guitars and drums, so all we'd really be doing do is singing. <laughs> yeah. And we're not the best singers. <laughs> not the best singers, well, but you guys know how to play. You, like, you guys let your instruments sing for you, right? Yeah. And yeah, 
So, uh, are there any any new bands or any new st any of the more contemporary stuff that you guys are into that you guys maybe listen to at least? Or oh, you like from? Wolf Mother? That's yeah, I yeah, band. yeah, Wolf Mother. I like a lot of their songs. They're, Cause they're they use they use like mostly guitar and everything and drums, and but like there's a few bands that are like still kind of in the classic rock and modern phase, and I like that. So I listen to a lot of them. <laughs> Get any comparisons to uh, at, at your school to Jonas Brothers or you guys? You guys recently did a show at your guys' school, right? Yeah. Yeah. Um, no, nope, they just think that we're just a band. Yeah. Some people are, like judgmental, yeah. but it, it just it doesn't really matter. Just ignore them. Tell me a little bit about, about the show you guys had at your school. Um, what was that like? Uh, well, I was principal that day because we had this thing called a hoedown where you can like go there and like. Uh, Win stuff. Win stuff. And he got the thing. And so. I, my parents got the uh, principal for the day for me. So I was principal of the day. And uh, then we were also playing there. And I just got my braces on. So my mouth, like, really hurt. It was incredibly nerve-wracking. I was shaking and the whole time. And we had to play, like, in front of our whole school, like, 300 people. Yeah, and our classes were, like, right next to us. Like, under there. Oh, it was scary. <laughs> you guys got through, though, huh? Yeah. yeah we did. Did everyone rock out there with you guys? <laughs> a lot of people are in their own world, just <laughs> randomly. But I, I think we did. We did okay. Yeah, it was just freaky. Yes. Very scary. Now you guys also have a little bit of a competition going on uh, with your GPAs, right? Yeah. Who has the high? Why don't you guys go ahead and uh, say who say what your GPAs are and who has the highest? I would have a four point oh, but my teachers. I have a four point oh, but he. I'm a seventh grader and he's an eighth grader, so. And I have a 3.95. But last year, he had all 4.0s, he said. Yeah. So. Wow. So you guys, you guys got 3.95, 4.0 GPAs, and you guys rock out on the weekends. That's, that's pretty fun, man. Yeah. <laughs> Before we wrap up here, you guys want to send any uh, special shout-outs to any of your friends, maybe the, the girls uh, out in uh, the Sledge Grits band? Oh, yeah. yeah. Have uh, fun in New York. Yes. Oh, oh. yeah. <laughs> Have, Have fun, fun in New, New York. York. Hope you guys win. <laughs> All right, uh, well, uh, continued success to you boys. Thank you so much. I know you guys rocked out here at uh, Wave Street Studios. You guys got any last shout outs before we let you go? Thank you for interviewing us. <laughs> oh, yeah, no problem, man. It's, it's my pleasure. It's my pleasure. All right, uh, Mark Abreto with themontereyherald.com slash the beat. Uh, thank you for watching the beat at Wave Street. See you guys. Yeah, I'm gonna blow my mind, mama.